I absolutely hate this time change. Um, I am going to talk briefly about um, parallelism in storytelling and how that is happening with the uh, Adam Page storyline right now. Um, the storyline as it is, is is Hangman just being a very sucky friend. Um, and the irony of that is that is the reason he had the falling out with Kenny and the Bucks is because they were really horrible friends. And that was always one of those funny things with the Bucks is they're not good faces. Even when they're trying to be faces, they're not good faces. And they and Kenny were just terrible to hangman and they made him feel inadequate and they made him feel like he didn't fit in and he was the lesser one and it was something that I don't know if Jay White started but it was something back when he and hangman were having the feud they were having that he kept talking about the fact that you know you're just pretending um and you're you're just the the lesser one in the group and that was the main the main big main thing about that particular situation was the fact that um, the Bucks always made him feel that way and Kenny made him feel that way and that's why he had the issues he had well now he's doing the same thing to the Dark Order and he's doing the same thing and hats off to Alex Reynolds who is really quite a good actor um, Hangman's doing the same thing he's blowing them off he's picking other people to tag with him he's basically making them feel like they are the kind of inadequate friends and that he's got bigger and better things to do which he then realizes and knows that he shouldn't do because he does then feel bad for it when he reacts certain ways and does certain things but he's still doing it and that is kind of the bigger issue with that particular story storytelling that you can have people treat you badly and then you can still go and treat other people badly it does not you being treated treated badly doesn't make you necessarily a good person and that is the story i think that is going on because he is being horrible to the dark order just like the bucks and kenny and the elite were to him and I think he would hate to know that he's doing that to people, but then he's also still doing it because he does still kind of realize what he's, what he's doing or he wouldn't keep apologizing just much like the elite did with him. So it's this whole sort of cycle of things going on that, okay, now you're champion and now you're this big top level person and now you don't have time for the friends that you had before just kind of like the situation that you had with the elite and I would hate to see the dark order not be face and I have a hard time with them not being face anymore just because they are so funny and the and the comedy is is so much there with them but if they're going to turn this could cause it because I don't see them making Adam turn. Um, he's just kind of being terrible, much like his friends were to him. And once again, it's the age old story of you can know something is wrong and have it done to you and feel bad about stuff, but you can also be somebody else's catalyst of discomfort I suppose that they were to you 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 can be bullied and still be a bully um and you can be a crappy fr friend on the receiving end of being a crappy friend and still be a crappy friend to other people and I think that's where they're going with this storytelling and I really do kind of like it because it's kind of going full circle and even the good guy can do stuff that the bad guys did to him as well. And it's a very good parallel.